These females can be as cold as ice or as hot as fire. For this list, we're looking at the lovely ladies of Westeros and those across the narrow sea. Pretty much all the women from the Game of Thrones TV series are up for the list, except for Sansa Stark because of her age. And seeing as though we're covering material from all seasons, let this be the moment for us to issue a massive spoiler warning. Number 10. Let's Shade. start with your last night in this world. In spite of having a rather common profession in Westeros, Shay managed to stand out from the crowd with her looks and instantly grabbed Tyrion Lannister's attention. From whom? She also grabbed ours with her sultriness and fiery accent. After that, it was her attitude and strength that kept us hooked. And we stayed that way right up until her betrayal. Guilty. He and Sansa planned it together. In her final moments, our hearts were as broken as Tyrion's. We admit, it was really hard not to get all choked up. Number 9. Ygritte. I want you to break him. Jon Snow may have known nothing, but we bet you're still a bit jealous of his relationship of this wildling beauty. Ygritte melted the ice of the north, and our hearts with her fiery red hair and smoky gaze. From her first seconds on screen, she won us over with her ferocity, and she remained one of our favorite characters even when she found herself on the side, opposing one of our favorite heroes. Did you pull a knife on me in the night? Number 8. Tyne Sand. You want a good girl, but you need the bad pussy. Who's the most beautiful woman in the world? Well, Tyne didn't top our list, but with those knives, we won't argue with her. One of Oberyn's daughters and a trained fighter. Time won a San Braun over with her jail cell seduction. Also, is it weird that the knife welding assassin thing makes her somehow more attractive? She's strong, confident, and deadly. She's everything you'd want in a woman. Number 7. Elaria Sand. Why? Because the ex Paramora of the deceased Prenzo Baron Martel. Elaria Sand is exotic and hotter than the Dornish Sun. She caught our attention with her looks and kept us captivated with her open approach to love and that accent, like the viper though. Her passion for vengeance knows no bounds. But that just makes us excited to see more of her on screen. Number 6. Miss Sande. Because there was a better choice. Once a slave who was freed by the mother of dragons, Miss Sande is now indebted to Daenerys Targaryen's cause, acting as her personal handmaiden, advisor and translator. We haven't seen too much in the way of romance in her character so far, except for some lingering glances and stolen kisses with Grey Worm. Wouldn't a relationship with him be difficult considering he's... Never mind. Not this. Missande has a gentle calmness to her piercing stare, and has us falling in love with her no matter what language she's speaking. And I will take you there. Number 5. Melisandre. I've said... Love her or hate her. Oh, he's not. You can't deny You're that the Red Christ. Woman's worth worshipping. A priestess for the Lord of Light. Yes. Melisandre has seduced many a Westerosi, both in a mental sense and physically. And full of she probably would have ranked higher on this list if she didn't come off as absolutely frightening half the time. Still, that whole mysterious dark magic thing she's rocking. Super hot. Number 4. Talisa Stark. It's true that real beauty is on the inside, but it doesn't hurt when the outside looks this good. A foreigner to Westeros, Talisa Stark, born Megir, came from Volantis and volunteered to treat wounded from both sides. In the midst of the War of Five Kings, I don't want to be a cripple, please. Surely one of our men needs your attention more than me. And it was during this time that she met her future husband, Rob Stark. I am hers, and she is mine. From, from this day. Until the end of my days. Thanks to her beauty, skills and more, she makes the king in the north betray his vows to Walder Frey's daughter Rosalind and marries her. Can you blame him? <laughs> Number 3. When Cersei you Lannister. Thrones, you win, or you die. There is no middle ground. We can't help it if we find power sexy. Because, well, it is. And Cersei Lannister knows it. Let's face it, there's something to be said for someone with constant resting bitch face. 
but who can make it work for her? I've changed my mind. Let On top of that, the Queen Regent of the Seven Kingdoms has the looks to match her own flinching resolve, pose and cunning. She does not mess around, unless it's with her blood relatives. Which is weird, when you think about it. So we won't. Number 2. Margery Tyrell. This way. Any ideas that this would-be queen was just another pretty face? Quickly went right out the window once we got to know her better. I want to be the queen. Margery has been able to play the Game of Thrones better than most, having been married to three people who call themselves king. I'm sorry, I... Of course, the first one wasn't really into her for obvious reasons, the second was a psycho, and the third one's like 15, but we won't so hold that against her. This royal rose owns every scene she's in with her grace and Most beauty. Don't know what they like until they Number 1. Daenerys Targaryen It had to be Daenerys Stormburn of House Targaryen, Queen of the Andals and the First Man, Mother of, you know what, you get the idea with platinum blonde hair and gentle eyes. We fell for her instantly, I've learned to really love her as she stepped into her role as a leader. And a woman of power. Oh, and did we mention how good looking she is? Let's just say. Daenerys has even walked through fire, hot enough to truly be one with her dragons. She soars above the competition and takes the number one spot on this list. Do you agree with our list? Who is your favorite female character from Game of Thrones? For more sexy top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to Tech Cargo.